All right, so what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you how to update your BIOS on our R710 system. So the first thing that we're looking at is if we notice over here, my PowerEdge R710 and my BIOS version is 6.30. <clears throat> so if we go to Dell support and we look up the BIOS for the R710, we can select the operating system. For me, I'm selecting Red Hat Enterprise. You could have something else. And if I download, I'm just looking for the system BIOS, so I check the system BIOS. So all I do is over here, this is my BIOS at 6.6, .6, or obviously it's higher, and I, <clears throat> and I need that one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this download. I'm just going to right click and copy the link. And then I'm going to open up PowerShell. I'm going to SSH into it. And I'm going to go into my server. And then I'm going to use the wget command to download it. <clears throat> but first, I'm going to make my directory. I'm going to call it drivers. I'm going to cd into drivers. Then I'm going to wget and copy over the link to the BIOS. Hit enter. And that downloads the BIOS. Now what I want to do is I'm going to look at it. So I see I have the um, BIOS there. I'm going to make sure that that's executable. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run it by hitting dot slash and then the uh, file name. But I'm not going to run it up here. I'm going to go down to my Axer server, and I'm actually going to run the the um, update um, from the system itself. That way, if something goes wrong, I'm, I'm wrong. I can actually get back into it um, and not lose my SSH uh, connection. So I'll be back. All right, sorry for the uh, video quality, but I don't have a screen capture down here on the system, but as you can tell, I'm going to run the update BIOS command. All right, and here it just shows the um, user agreement. But one thing that I wanted to point out was like right here under the description, it shows that the BIOS version is going to be 6.60. I'm going to head hit Q to get out of the um, notes. And then down here, it's going to tell me about the um, version update. It recognized that I have 6.3 installed and the package it wants installed is 6.6. .6. So we'll just go ahead and hit yes. And we'll let it run its course. And when it's done, I'll be back. Right, so we're attempting the BIOS update. And here we go at the last step. We just have to reboot our system for things to take place. So we're just going to hit yes. All right. So I'm back upstairs. And as you notice, the um, closed my connection. That's because, you know, it rebooted and everything. So that's as expected. So now what we're going to end up doing is I'm going to refresh this. Put uh, in my password. Alright, so we refreshed it. And now, if you notice, we have buyer's version 6.60 so we successfully um, updated the buyers all right 
panel. I'll let you guys go. If there's any questions, um, please like and subscribe and put any questions down below. Thank you.